This young man is extraordinary. He may hold the key to a long and healthy life for us all. He lives with his family in a remote town in South Ecuador. Yannick may look younger than 10 years old. But he's actually 17. He will grow old differently to the rest of us. And he'll be immune to the diseases of old age, including cancer and diabetes. We'd all love to know the secrets to a long and healthy life. And scientists now know more about what we can do to age better than ever before. And the latest research from around the world could help us all put the brakes on the aging process. In America, we discover simple changes to our diet which can help keep us healthy and sharp, even past our 100th birthday. Disabled card belongs to my wife, that's not mine. <laughs> In Germany, we follow a groundbreaking study that reveals which exercise holds off aging the most. So it's a very complex activity, much more challenging than just going to the gym. How the power of positive thinking can make us all seven years younger. A bit like Donald Trump. <laughs> and we find out the simple things that we can all do to help us live longer. I'm going to try and improve on it when I get home. No, it's too easy. Could try harder, maybe live longer. So if you've ever wanted to turn back the clock, then science may now hold the key. Aging is something that happens to us all. It's inevitable. But what's not inevitable is how we make that journey. How can we give ourselves the best chance to reach old age and get there fit and healthy and still getting as much out of life as possible? It's not just what we do physically that can help us fight aging. Scientists know that mental attitude and our approach to old age can have a big effect too. I'm Chris Van Tulliken, doctor and research scientist, and I'm about to undertake an unusual experiment. Aging seems to be a paradox, doesn't it? 